Before the COVID-19 pandemic, low-income seniors would visit their doctor for treatment. But as our ABC 10 News reporter Steve Smith tells us, an El Cajon clinic has made life easier during the quarantine by putting its office on four wheels. Doug Roberts usually visits St. Paul's Pace for treatment about once a week. Pace stands for Program for the All-Inclusive Care of the Elderly. Dr. Victor Lee says when the COVID-19 pandemic hit, a change had to be made in the way they cared for their patients. They used to come to a clinic for services, they still do, but because of self-isolation and some people have fear of being in a crowded place, we have to find a way to take care of them. This is our answer to that. Their answer is called the Roving Clinic. Our staff came up with some creative ways and one of the ways we did was to create and convert a van into a clinic so we can go to their home to take care of them. The van is considered a safe place. 130 over 80. Medication helps. Yes, it does. The doctors can examine them. The nurses can do the vital signs. Whatever we can do in the clinic, we try to replicate inside the van. Now, there are currently about 1,000 patients in the program, and many, as Dr. Lee describes, as frail with multiple medical problems. But so far, the roving clinic has been a lifesaver. Have heart problems, high blood pressure. They love it. We go to their place, we go to a park outside the apartment, or sometimes even in the parking lot somewhere. There's privacy, we take care of them right there. For the elderly, the roving clinic is medical care with peace of mind. We're all done here. In El Cajon, Steve Smith, ABC 10 News. The St. Paul's Place currently has a couple of vans in use for their roving clinics, but the goal is to get a new larger customized van.